This video will cover the steps to calibrate Phil Wright's 800 and 900 series mechanical meters. First, identify the direction of flow in your application. Then, install your meter accordingly. Even though all Phil Wright meters are factory calibrated, it's important to recalibrate your meter once it is installed in your specific application to ensure accurate metering. Once your meter is installed, you can calibrate it. To do this, you will need a container with a known volume, like a proving can, a flat blade screwdriver, and a rag to remove any residual fluid. Make sure to wear proper PPE while calibrating your meter. We recommend wearing both eye protection and rubber gloves. First, you will need to fill a container of a known volume. We will be using a five gallon proving can. Once your container is filled, check the meter register. If it is exactly filled to the known quantity, in this case, five gallons, your meter is properly calibrated. If the meter register shows more or less than the known quantity, you will need to adjust the calibration screw. On the 800 mechanical meters, the calibration screw is located near the outlet port on the side of the pump housing. On the 900 mechanical meters, it is located near the outlet port on a diagonal. To access the calibration screw, you will need to remove the seal screw and the O-ring. The calibration screw is behind the seal screw inside the cavity. Note that one full turn is equal to about one-tenth of a gallon. If the meter is more than five gallons, you will need to turn the screw counterclockwise to adjust. If the meter is less than five gallons, then you will need to turn the screw clockwise to adjust. Repeat this process until the known amount dispensed matches the amount shown on the meter. Once the amounts match, your meter is properly calibrated. Thank you for watching this fill right video.